I absolutely have to share this news with you. I learned this from my lender a couple days ago, and she literally said, yeah, you can reduce your monthly payment without having to pay a dime to refinancing or really doing anything. All you have to do is make one phone call. We'll talk about that uh, in just a minute as exactly what that is. And let me tell you, um, it's, it's something in the 20 years of doing real estate, I have never heard as an option. I've heard a lot of different things, um, you know, if, especially if you're in a crunch on your mortgage, but this has nothing to do with any type of short sale, loan modification, anything like that. But if you're in a situation where your monthly payments are getting tough for you as taxes have started increasing, we're going to talk about this reason and um, the, the way to get those lowered and make it easier for you to make those payments. And so bottom line is, is that this is just such a simple, simple way to get this done. Like I said, my lender uh, posted this on her feed and I just thought this was amazing. I was like, man, I, I, how did I not know this? It's, uh, you know, you're always learning in real estate. I'll say I've been doing this in almost 20 years. Like I said, 19 years now, I'm always learning something new. Uh, and so by the way, if you haven't already subscribed or liked our channel, please do so. We'll do some updates on occasion uh, and certainly would hope that you would like to do that and get some good information, whether it be about housing or what's going on in the community. We're always going to post something here um, and uh, we hope that you would enjoy it. That said, let's get into what this crazy thing is. Literally, you do not have to pay a dime. All it comes down to is one phone call. And what's going on right now? Well, the taxes, right? Everybody, I've been getting a million calls lately from past clients, people around the neighborhood of Aubrey or Little Elm or really anywhere around our office as well, uh, saying, hey man, can you send me some comps? I wanna get my taxes lowered. And unfortunately, a lot of those comps that come back are just not good enough to get those particular people's taxes low enough, or they've lived in their house so long that they, you know, in the last more than more than a year, more than two years in this case, um, they have their homestead exemption or some exemption on on file there, where their taxes went up a certain amount but didn't go up crazy, or maybe it did go up crazy. It's a rental property or some such. That said, you have the ability to actually modify how those taxes are paid. So. Everybody in the last couple months had received a tax bill from the uh, appraisal district and everybody was shocked in terms of how high those values went up. And it's just, you know, why has that been happening over the last three to five years? I think it's due to the fact that they started hiring realtors and they have MLS capability, more software data, things of that nature, where previously, pre, pre five years ago, they didn't really have as much good software. They just kind of winged it, right? They looked at you know realtor.com or whatever was out there in terms of evaluation. Uh, and we didn't have all this really great valuation data information. Um, and this year, it may be because there is some stuff going on at the Texas legislature that would potentially push our um, homestead exemption from 10% down to 5%. And if that were to happen, that means less tax dollars for the government, right? And so there may be something to that, can't say for sure. That all being said, all of our taxes went up and that has put real pressure on people's ability to pay for their taxes and really their monthly payment. And so what can you do to mitigate that? They give you a couple options already. They say, okay, your taxes in this next 12 months are gonna go up. Uh, you can pay this on a one lump sum amount, this 500, 800, 700, whatever it's gonna be additional so your payment can stay the same if you have a mortgage company right uh, your mortgage company will send you that saying hey what do you want to do here after you get the tax bill and they'll say you know you can do it however you want we can pay it in one lump sum we can stretch it out over those 12 months and your payment will increase forty dollars seventy dollars ninety dollars or whatever it's going to be or the third option which i did not know about was that you can actually call into the escrow department at your mortgage company and ask them, say, hey, can we please stretch this out over 36 months? <gasps> and right now may be a good idea to do that because the possibility 
of you know prices increasing next year is very unlikely. Well, in some markets, right? Depends on where you're at. That said, prices, you know, we've already seen a huge decrease in prices over the nation uh, as a whole. And so in many markets, you may want to say, look, I don't want to pay an additional $90 a month or whatever amount. And so that said, you can go in there and say, hey, are you willing to let me do this for 36 months uh, over the course of these um, these this, this new adjusted payment? And then the hope would be that, you know, next year they go down a little bit and potentially who knows on the third year. That said, though, if you're just in an absolute crunch and you you don't want to have to pay it um, and you would prefer to drag it out a little bit, you absolutely can do it. Um if as long as the lender allows, right? And it's not any kind of loan modification. It's not a short sale. It's just them allowing you to pay it out over a longer duration. Whenever my lender friend told me this, I was like shocked. I was like, I've never heard this ever. Couldn't believe it. And so I, you know, I personally, you know, I'm, I don't know if I want to do that because obviously I have multiple properties that, um, you know, I have and, and would say that the, the possibility of, the next year going up is there, but it's extremely, extremely unlikely. And so the likelihood of it actually going down is there. So you may even have to pay less over the course of um, the years to come, right? So anyway, I thought that was an amazing idea uh, and hope you do too. Once again, please do like, subscribe to our page. We're going to give you some little tidbits here and there when it comes to your mortgage, housing, neighborhoods, all that kind of good stuff. If you have any questions about real estate, please do reach out. We're here to help. Thanks again.